Hey everybody. Look at this. No. No, my creature is not flexing for that uh that thing over there. My creature is actually spitting at that. So I've been uh rapidly spitting at this guy for about five minutes. Got him down to four hundred and twenty one health. This is how to kill an epic creature. So you're gonna wanna have like a spit level four or five ish, maybe three. But those are ideals. You can do this at any level. Um, so you gotta stand behind your nest here with the epic creature on the opposite side. Um. If the conditions are ideal, then you can have your pack attack him and he won't be able to do anything. This is a great time to uh, stock up on rogue creatures in your pack. After that, you just stand behind the nest so that you don't die. Your allies maul him to death. And uh, he, he dies eventually. Also... Some of your nest mates will uh, kill him too. So, let's continue that. No, 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 no. Stay here. Dun, 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 dun. Also, be warned, these are your nest mates. So while you're being brutally mauled and killing this giant thing here, um, there they might be dancing or singing or socializing. Got him down to 200. Yeah, it's, it's the best when the, you have these ideal conditions. So that, you know, you're not just sitting here dealing like, uh, two, three damage with each hit. Your friends are also dealing like, uh, Additional 20 damage. He's almost dead. Almost dead. Almost. And... Kick in the face. Now comes the feast. It's kind of strange since uh, this guy is... You know, a giant skeleton. Yeah. Yum. Yeah. And that was killing an epic creature in significantly less than two hours. <sighs> All the while, this creature is trying to mate with me. Silly creature. Alright, bye everybody. For now.